It's giveaway time. Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. We're gonna have in our video of today a Ethereum TA and also this is gonna be the subscription video for our $10 worth of Bitcoin weekly giveaway. So make sure to subscribe here to the channel on Twitch and also on YouTube, Alessandro the Crypto, and also put in the YouTube video your comment and your Bitcoin address on this video to participate on our $10 worth of Bitcoin giveaway sponsored by Bityard. So shout out to the people over there on Bityard. Bityard is the number one exchange if you want to trade cryptos and derivatives with your Tether. So here you can trade all the cryptos and derivatives that you want only just putting Tether here, no KYC, nothing. Just open up an account with the link that you find down below here in the video description with my link you support the channel and uh, you can just load up your Tether in there and trade everything you want. So in today's video, we're going to have a small Ethereum price update because Ethereum currently is in a very critical point, same like Bitcoin. Here you can see the four hour time frame and it looks like that currently we are still trading on the bearish side. So we should expect still some continuation to downside. But also here on Ethereum, I still expect a possible bounce towards the $400 resistance. So if you want to short or sell your Ethereum, then watch out here for the $400 level because I think there is still a very high chance that we could go up there to retest this price level. And if there we are getting rejected, then this could be a potential good short opportunity or sell opportunity. And if you already took out profits in Tether, then you can still trade Ethereum here on BTR. And uh, currently you can see that the RSI is still in oversold condition. So a bounce to the upside is still expected. Currently we're trading here below the middle line here in the Bollinger Band, so below 350 dollars we are in a very critical point here on ethereum if you're able to push through 350 then watch out for the 400 dollar level also if we switch over here into the moving averages and into my own indicator you can see that currently we had a buy signal and that there is a very high chance that we could go and retest the 20 moving average at 360 and maybe even go higher towards the 200 moving average which is lining up at 400 dollar here in the four hour time frame so even though it's still looking like we could see a continuation to the downside here, there is still a high chance that first maybe we're, go we're coming up to retest one of these moving averages, especially here the $400 level. And uh, we can also go over to the daily time frame because here you can see that after overshooting the Bollinger Band to the downside, currently we're retracing back here into the lower end. So we are still bearish here, at least for now. But the continuation here to the upside to potentially test the middle line here of the Bollinger Band, which here in the daily is at exactly $400, I think it's still likely. So also if Bitcoin is coming up to retest the 11K area and get rejected there, then watch out for Ethereum because here we could see a similar thing like on Bitcoin, a possible short lift bounce to the upside to test the $400. And there is where we're gonna see if we're gonna have continuation to the upside potentially to retest 450 or maybe even higher or if we are getting rejected here and continue to dump to the downside. So if we're gonna see something like this, then this most likely is gonna be short-lived. So we're gonna have potentially a very short-lived bounce to the upside and here a clear rejection or a continuation to the upside. The RSI is also getting here in oversold condition. So I think a bounce to the upside is coming up pretty soon. The question is only uh, if we are able also to break it here the new resistance or not so watch out for these targets and if you want to trade it with your tether if you already took out profits especially here after we overshooted the bollinger band to the upside here when we topped out at 480 dollars then maybe you can uh, still trade here ethereum and bitcoin or whatever coin you want because with the profits that you took out here if you took out profits so with your tether you're still a 
um, you can still manage to trade all the cryptos you want with leverage because here on some altcoins you can trade up to ADX leverage on Bitcoin you can go up to 100x leverage and here also comes the interesting thing if you want to trade oil gold and so on you can also do that here with your tether without KYC nothing and here you can even trade up to one to 200x leverage so because here we don't have usually big movements in the price action unless of course uh, what we're seeing right now with all these uh, virus thing we have also here in the oil and the gold price big moves so then you don't have to go necessarily with high leverage but usually we always have a very low percentage moves and that's why here you can also trade up to 200x leverage which makes also trading derivatives uh, a bit more interesting and of course the more you trade here on BTRT, the more bonus you get you can get up to 258 dollars in bonus the last one is here up to 188 dollars which you then can use to trade or of course also withdraw if you surpass 1 million dollars in trading volume and this is included leverage so if you go always with high leverage in even with small amounts you can easily get this bonus as well and if you tune in every day here into the exchange you will uh, get to this uh, website here uh, where it says um, daily mining you're not really going to mine here tether or anything like that but you can just click here on this mining button and immediately you can get some free tether that you can use uh, uh, to trade with or of course also withdraw it's a small amount every day that you get but at the end you can also trade with that money completely riskless so with that said guys i'm gonna wrap it up for now this this was just a small ethereum price update and this is also my targets here for the next uh, couple of hours and days since we are now trading below the 20 and 50 daily moving average also here on the ethereum price my target is still to see a possible bounce here towards 400 dollars so towards the 20 daily moving average but if we are getting rejected here i'm getting a bit more bearish not only on bitcoin but also here on ethereum because in that case i think it is very very likely that we're coming down to test the 200 daily moving average on bitcoin and also on ethereum on bitcoin it would mean something around 9k and on ethereum 250 dollars if we're going to lose the 200 daily moving averages on ethereum and bitcoin then i think this will take down uh, also all the other altcoins and also we will see most likely um the bearish scenario playing out where we're gonna most likely going to test the 200 weekly moving average in the ethereum and also bitcoin price which will be another like 20 to 30 percent drop hopefully not but everything is possible and you should be prepared for all scenarios and don't forget that you always can trade it over on bityard all right guys don't forget put down below here your comment and your bitcoin address to participate on our bitcoin giveaway we're gonna select the winner at the end of the week so thank you very much for watching my friends and we're gonna see us all in the next one bye